everybody. It's Deb from Dandy Art Gallery. Hope you're all doing well today. Today I have a 10 by 20 canvas that I'm going to do a swipe on and um, we'll go over my colors. My base coat I have down is DecoArt Metallic Rose Gold. And my next color is DecoArt Metallic Copper. Very, very pretty colors. My swipe color today is going to be Folk Art Pearl White. My next color is the King Art Paints, and it's a combination of um, pearl black and silver. Just wanted to darken that silver up just a little bit. My next paint is the King Art Magenta. And I just received my Color Art Primary Elements. Pretty excited about that. So I'm using the Blue Bayou today. Very pretty color. And also the um, Hot Cinnamon. I had no idea it was going to turn out so red. So we're just going to see how that goes. My pouring medium today is about one part Floetrol to one part paint and a squirt of GAC 800 and about a teaspoon of the Liquitex um, gloss medium and varnish. And I did not add silicone today. So let's get started with uh, layering the paints. I am going to do a swipe. I'm not going to layer the paints all the way down this time. Oh, I want to put it, I'm going to do two lines here now that I remember. I want my swipe color in the middle. I'll be swiping on both sides. Here's that silver that I made up. I just made it like a medium toned silver, not real light. And next I'm going to put the primary elements hot cinnamon down. And again, I had no idea it would be this bright, but let's hope that it really adds something to this painting. Next, I'm going to add the copper. And end with the blue. And now that I look at it, I think I am going to add a little bit more. A little bit more of the uh, magenta here. I don't think I got enough on there. And also, I am going to add some more of that 
that crimson. I really like the looks of that. And I think it's going to have, really add some depth to this painting. So we're gonna put another layer of that on. Okay. And why don't I end with another layer of the copper. And that should be really good. I didn't go over consistency, but I did leave my paints a little bit on the thinner side today for this white. And I'm going to add, again, just a little bit more of this magenta on this side. I think I need a little bit more over there. Okay. All right, now my swipe color. Okay. Actually, that is thicker than I wanted but I'll just have to work with it here and see how it goes. That was the Folk Art Pearl White. That's white color. Okay. Just move my paints here a minute. And I have little plastic sheets here that I'm going to be swiping with today. And we're just going to see how these go. I'm actually putting a little bit of pressure in there. And I'm not necessarily going down to the end either. Got all different widths. And I may come back and just re-swipe in those open areas. We'll just have to see how it goes. And I'm going to re-swipe here. And I'm going to re-swipe here. Okay. Now I'm going to turn it over. And let's swipe the other side. I think I'm going to start in the middle this time. And I may add just a little bit more of that swipe color. I'm 
Okay. And I will re-swipe this now. I'm using paint sample cards for some of my swipes also. Okay, and I think I am going to just swipe some of these areas that are left open. And I'm going to turn it over again. I'm going to do a little more swiping. Okay, and now I think I'll torch it. And now I think I'm going to do a little bit of tipping here. let some of this run down and then run back. Okay, and you know what color I really think is special in here is that blue. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my skewer and I'm going to take the blue paint 
and I'm just going to run it run it down a little bit just to enhance that a little bit and I am using the blunt end of my skewer Okay, and now I'm going to turn it over and do the same on the other side. And I hope that this is in frame. I'm just trying to run these lines where they look, would look natural. Okay, and I'm going to do some more tipping. And I'm going to tip again. These colors are just beautiful in here. And you'll see when you get down for a close up. Very, very happy with the way this turned out. Just going to turn it, tip it back a little bit again. Okay. And I am going to torch it again. Very, very beautiful. A lot of shimmer and shine going on in this painting.
Just going to add a little bit more of the base coat right here. And I will fix up my edges off camera. A lot going on. I've got a lot of lacing going on. Very pretty. And I was so afraid that that cinnamon would be too much, but it's it, it's really nice in this painting. So I'll get you down for a close-up. Again, this is a 10 by 20 canvas. Did a simple swipe on, using a lot of metallics and my new color art paints. So here is the upper left-hand corner, and hopefully you can just see all this shimmer and shine in here. Beautiful. Got a lot of cells. Love the colors. There are just so many pretty areas. A lot of lacing going on here too. Very nice. Just take you across here a little bit and then back up. More lacing. And that blue added a lot to this painting. Very pretty in here. Here's another nice area. Again, a lot more lacing and cells. Looks like a rainbow in here. And I'll take you up here. Very pretty. This area is very nice here. And this is the upper right hand corner. Really pretty in there too. Very happy with this painting. Okay, let me know what you think. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Make sure you share it. Ring the bell and choose all so you know the next time that I do post a new video. And until next time, oh, and subscribe if you haven't. That would be great. Until next time, take care, everybody. Bye for now.